questions that I encounter when I teach courses, when I teach classes, and I'm sure that you have the same situation is, um, what do I do when I get stuck? If I get stuck, then, then what? I mean, I've done an induction and then I don't know what the heck to do with this person. <laughs> well, um, for the new hypnotist, I would say that, uh, that this will work itself out. You will, you will gain experience and you will instinctively know what to do with the clients. Uh, until that happens though, I think it's best for the new hypnotist just to, to do research. When the person makes the appointment with you, find out what they want to work on. And then, then you can do the necessary research to give you some, some strategies to use during the session. Um, it's funny though, Eugene, when you, when you first said that, the first thing that flashed into my mind was Gil Boyne. Okay. Uh, he was, he was one of my teachers and there would sometimes come a period in the therapy where he obviously was not sure which way to go. Okay. And you would see him pause and he would sometimes put the client on hold and he'd say, that's right. Well, you just sit there and continue to breathe in relaxation and exhale tension and worry. I'm going to give you a period of silence during that period. Each time you exhale, you go deeper. That period begins now. Oh, wow. And then you okay. go, hmm. <laughs> <laughs>